Well, good morning, and we have a surprise birth. I did not realize Bessie had gotten pregnant in our transition to the land. I always thought she was too young. Um, she's definitely a year old in February, so she was way too young for us to really breed them normally. But in our transition area, our temporary location, there wasn't much space, so we had to... Um, at first, we separated the boys and girls, and then um, they... I think in, in transition, she must have been um, made it. But look at this tricolor girl. We have another doe, and she's tricolor, guys. She's got brown and black on her face, and she's got a white body like her mother, and little spots, little cute little spots on her. She is so beautiful. She is so beautiful. I'm getting away because her mom is probably going to have another one. And um, they usually have them in pairs. And she's trying to take care of her. Bessie's not really, she's really skittish around people. But my gosh, yes, I normally would wait just uh, like a year and a half to two years before they, I allow them to mate like that. And it, I feel, I don't know how I feel about it, to be honest with you. I'm just glad that their baby's healthy. And she is just gorgeous. She's gorgeous, guys. What a beautiful little baby, a tricolor female. We have been so blessed this year. We have so far one buck, four does now, four. So I'm just, I'm just ecstatic. It has just been amazing. And the, as you can see, the two that uh, Dottie had, which is behind them, are doing really well. They're growing quickly, and then. That's the main bug, uh, Jack, but he is not the daddy of that one. Um, <clears throat> he's the daddy of that one is no longer here. And then we have these two does, which was from Faith, which is behind them. I just got their feet, and they want to see what's in the bucket. These guys have gotten so adventurous. When I turn the fence off, they know it. They all go roaming around and playing everywhere. So I have to really take care and watch them because that highway up there and goats can wander off uh, as they get older a good bit just to explore and browse. Oh, I can't believe that. I had no clue she didn't even look pregnant. What a cute little baby. I love that baby. I love all of them. You can tell I get really excited about the babies in the spring. Soon our birds will start laying eggs, and that's going to be exciting. But anyway, um, thanks for joining me this morning. And I just wanted to share that with everyone.